Hi, my name is Corey Ferrier, and this is a demo of my Clocks for Kids web app. This is meant to teach kids how to read an analog clock, because they might not necessarily know how to do that. Um, so you enter a first name and a last name, and you hit sign in, and it gives you a randomly generated clock here for your use, and you have to try and guess what the time it's displaying is. So I'm going to try and get it exactly right here. This is 1.55. And it'll tell me that I got it exactly right, and it'll give me a link to go on to another randomly generated problem. You'll also see that it kept track of my number of correct answers, my number of attempts, and it gave me a score of 100. Now for this one, I'm going to intentionally get the hours wrong at the beginning. So let's put 8. And it's going to say check the hour hand first and try again. So giving the kids a little bit of um, a nudge in the right direction. Hey, you should check this first. So I'm going to do that, and I'm going to do 6, and I'm going to do the time slightly off. So I'm going to do 6.53. And it's going to tell me that I was close. Uh, it's going to tell me what the correct answer was, and it's going to give me a point anyway. This is to avoid people getting frustrated because, they, you know, they, they thought the minute's hand was just one off. You don't want the kids getting frustrated for small stuff like that. Um, and if I hit next, it's going to give me another randomly generated problem. Now, if I sign out, and I log in as do Brad Simon, why not? Um, you'll see that my score was reset, my correct answers were, and so were my attempts, because I'm playing as a different user now. So if I do 1240 uh, here, 20, I'm sorry, um, it'll tell me you know, the very similar message, uh, you were close, the correct answer was 1219, and he'll get 100 points too. Now if I sign out and I go back to playing as Corey, you'll see that my score was remembered as were my number of correct answers and my number of attempts. So as long as someone doesn't refresh the page, it keeps track of their scores and kids can come and go as they want to. Now if I log in with the teacher password, I go to check scores, I can see all the students' scores and number of attempts, number they got correct. Not maybe as a way of grading them, maybe also as a way of just monitoring every, everyone's progress, seeing where they're at. So it's a very straightforward web app, but it does its job well, and it should be fun with the score system.